Good day, viewers. Tonight I have purchased this Lanson ceiling fan off of Gumtree. This is something rare because um, not many Lanson ceiling fans are around, but this is the only one I got hardly used, still in its original box. And the reason for this video tonight is I thought I'd unbox. I thought I'd open the box for you to show what's inside. <laughs> but I'll hang it up tomorrow and test it out. Oh, no. My dad's watching the rugby. Gosh, this is bad. Okay, Let's see what's inside. This fan has not been used for such a, for such a long time. And it's been waiting for the day. Customer service warranty. Screws here. <coughs> Instructions. Surely this is a hang shaw. Yep, hang sure. Um, so we'll be reading this side here. Get under here. There it is. Perfectly white colour. Obviously because this fan is brand new. Most of these fans, you'll find them just like cheap and they just go yellow and stuff. These blades are so light. And you can tell this thing is cheaply made. So, oh, I'm going to only need the uh, brown wire, blue wire and... The ground wire, the rest of the wires are like for the, for the light. We don't need that. Yeah. So that's the light and that's the motor right here. And this will be its three speed, speed regulator. There's my foot there. Oh yeah. Something I remember from my childhood is seeing one of those three speed regulator thingies here. These types. Pretty old. The instructions for the, <coughs> the motor itself right here. pristine condition for this for this type of fan old fans but those old type of fans um they have a um uh, a silver nut but for for these modern type of these fans like those um hpms they will have a white one on the bottom, but if the fan is is um, stainless steel, it would have a silver nut. So, yeah, something to note. <coughs> it's 
blades. It's one, two, and there's number three there. These these blades, they're pretty cheap. They're not they're like not that heavy to handle. Unlike my uh SMC Wattmaster down there. I still need to get new bearings for it. Obviously regreasing the bearings haven't made a difference at all. So anyway. There's the uh <coughs> Hangshaw mount right there. Yep, just right there. I can just slip off. <coughs> I don't know what's this for, but um, it's already got a ground lie here. I don't know what's the point of this, but I suppose it's for when placing the regulator on. So I can just wire the ground wire directly to there, and the regulator doesn't need it. So pretty much, I guess it's for <coughs> wherever you install, if it has a ground wire or if it doesn't. So something op something optional. And there's the screws for holding up the canopy. So I'll place this back on for now. Alright, I'm just going to um, place everything back in the box for now, until tomorrow. <coughs> Again, I do apologise for the for my dad in the background, he's watching the rugby. Good to see the user manuals here. Worth keeping for collection. For my collection, sorry. Alright. Thank you for watching. <laughs>